Hi guys, before I start talking, um, here's my new room. I moved into a condo and I had a poo. Okay, alright, so I'm gonna get straight to the point. Uh, so like basically I have discovered something that I really didn't know about and it's called a uh, bi-gender. And uh, for the longest time, I mean, I guess I'm gonna go in depth into my sexuality gender-wise because I know before all this YouTube stuff I had, um, like maybe a couple years ago, like four years ago I think that's when my whole Mr. Lee persona started and where everyone started asking, what are you? Are you a boy or a girl? Are you a boy or a girl? Are you a boy? You know, that constant freaking question. And like, I just got sick and tired of it, like, of answering it. And sometimes I just mess with people and I just make, I just confuse them even more. So anyways, I'm going to explain myself in this video. I'm going to explain myself. So like, when I was 13, I felt like I was bi, okay? I mean, I never really thought about my gender. It was, I thought my sexuality was a crisis to me at the time, so like, I thought I was bi. Then I thought I was like lesbian when I hit, I think, uh, high school. And then I came to the term that I thought I was bi again because I was confused. And then I went to this term where I thought I was a gay boy trapped in a girl's body. And so that's when you, I started questioning am I a transgender. Then it went from a, I'm a girl, I'm a lesbian trapped in a gay guy's body, trapped in a girl's body. See, so see how complicated it gets. Um, I guess what I'm trying to say is that all my life, uh, since I was little, I never really felt like quite like a girl or quite like a boy. Only I've always had, as you can see. I mean, if you know me or have seen my videos, I really jump around. Like I. I can be like a boy one day, I could be a girl the next day, I could look like a gay guy one day, and I could look like a freaking dyke the next day. Like, I just, I do, I dress the way I want, I, I be who I want, and what I feel like being that day. Okay, so, I do change a lot, and I noticed that about me. Um, so basically, I guess, I'm, I came with a term where it actually does describe me, and it's the word bigender, which I kind of discovered recently, which means that you are basically a boy and a girl, gender-wise. So basically, I'm not just like thinking that, oh, I'm just a girl, or I'm not thinking, oh, I just feel like a boy, which usually refers to transgenders if, if it was in the case for me. But I've always felt like a boy, and I've always felt like a girl. I feel like I can have that ability to like switch on as to the other one if I wanted to, and which I did, because throughout my whole life, I pretty much did, and I pass, I pretty much pass for it. Like, if I want to be a boy, I pass for a boy, I pass for a girl, like whatever I want to do. So anyways, that's me for now. That's what I guess I thought I would come out with on this video. Uh, since I haven't really uploaded a video, I promised that I would upload. So that's me. I'm Jay and I feel like I'm just both of them. Like I'm not really like t tied to one. So, and when it comes to my sexuality, like, that's just a whole different scenario. Like, to me, sexuality, I'm mostly attracted to girls. But, like, at the same time, I'm really open-minded. And at the same time, I don't like a specific type of girls. Like, I like all types. I don't care if they're boyish, they're girly, they're, they're this and that. To me, it's, um, it's all about the personality and their soul and the way they carry themselves it just doesn't matter i think every type is like very intriguing to me so yeah anyways i guess that's for today this is the only video i wanted to upload about so all right and if you're somewhat feeling like how i feel you should drop a comment below so i feel like i'm not the only one so yeah all right peace